In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can make an awesome Roblox shirt just like the one I'm wearing right now for free in 2023. And this method doesn't require Photoshop or Roblox Premium. So if you want the best and easiest step-by-step -step tutorial on how to make your own Roblox clothes, then let's get straight into it. The first thing that you want to do is go to the Roblox website and then go ahead and press on the Create tab. And it should bring you to this page right here. But if it doesn't bring you to this page, don't worry. Because if your page looks like this, all you have to do is press Manage My Experiences. And it'll take you to the correct page. Once you're here, what you want to do is press on shirts. And now what we want to do is get the template to make our Roblox shirt. To do that, we just want to press the download it here button and just go ahead and save this image to our computer by right clicking on it and pressing save image as. After you do that, you want to go in the description down below and then go to photop.com. And for those of you who don't know, Photop is basically Photoshop, but for free and online. And this is what we're actually going to be making our free Roblox shirt in. So to open up our template, we just want to press this button right here. And then we just want to go ahead and select our template. Once we have it loaded, up in our software what we want to do is just press this magnifying glass tool and just zoom in a little bit to make it a bit easier to work with now what we want to do is go to this tool right here and now what we're going to go ahead and do is just drag this tool across these colored parts right here and once you got it perfectly lined up you just want to go ahead and press the delete key on your keyboard and as you can see we'll make it png and you just want to go ahead and do this for the whole template and if you mess up like this where you don't get the full color deleted all you have to do is hold down control and then press z and that will redo your last action once your shirt template looks like this, what we're going to do now is figure out what color we're going to use. So just go ahead and look up whatever color you want. And then once you go ahead and find a good color you like, you're just going to right click on it and save the image as again. And then go back to photo P, go in the upper left hand corner, press on file, press open in place, and go ahead and select on that color. And it should go ahead and open up behind your shirt. But if it's like this in photo P, all you have to do is just drag this layer under the template and bam, you should be good to go. Now what we want to do is press edit, press free transform, and just resize it so it fits the whole shirt. I'd recommend though to leave this part PNG with nothing covering it because this part right here are your hand holes. So if you want your hands to be showing on your Roblox character, I'd recommend just leaving this blank. Now what we want to do is add whatever we want to this Roblox shirt. So you can go ahead and find whatever pictures you want online and just place it on this Roblox shirt. Just like how we got the color from online and added it to the photo P program. So I'm gonna go ahead and press on file, open in place, and I'm gonna go ahead and add this like button to my shirt. We can just go ahead and resize it to fit the torso part of our shirt. And if we go ahead and put it right here, this means it'll be right on front of the shirt. But if you want it on the back, you would put it right here. Or if you want something on the sleeves, you would go ahead and put that right here. I'm gonna go ahead and also add the subscribe button to our shirt, which you should totally do by the way. And I'm just gonna put it right on the back of our shirt. Once you've added all the details that you want to your shirt, you just wanna go ahead and press file, press export as, and go ahead and press PNG. You can go ahead and rename it to whatever you want and just press save. And now we're gonna go ahead and upload our shirt to Roblox. So we're just gonna go ahead and press choose file and go ahead and select our shirt and we can name the shirt whatever we want and now we just want to press upload for 10 robux also by the way if you don't have any robux at all and want to upload your shirt for free after you're done watching this video go in the description down below and i'll show you how to get free robux super fast using microsoft rewards and some other methods but just a quick tip to get some fast free robux you can go to your settings and then go to billing and you see where it says roblox credit you just might have some roblox credit lying around and if you do you can just go ahead and press claim and that credit will turn into free robux and that should be enough to upload your Roblox shirt. Once you get your Robux, you just want to go ahead and press confirm and your shirt will be uploading to Roblox. And the reason that it's not showing up instantly is it might take a while to upload and for Roblox to actually check to see if there's anything bad on your shirt. But as long as there's nothing bad on your shirt, it can take anywhere from 10 minutes to maybe an hour. But in the meantime, what I'd recommend to do is press on this gear icon right here, press configure, and it will bring you to this page right here. And here you can change the description of your shirt, the name of your shirt, and most importantly, you can list it to sell for Robux. And what you want to do is just press this on sale Roblox button. And here you can set your Roblox shirt to any price you want. I'm just going to go ahead and make it a solid 10 Robux. But just remember that Roblox takes 30% of whatever you sell your shirt for. So just for example, if I sold it for 10 Robux, I'd only get 7. After Roblox takes its cut. Once we do that, all we have to do is press save changes. And now we just have to wait a little bit for the shirt to finish uploading. Now as you can see, after an hour of waiting, the shirt is uploaded. And this is what the shirt looks like on my avatar. As you can see, we have the like button on the front and the subscribe button on the back. Even though it's a very simple design, I think it looks really cool. But before you go, if you want to figure out how to get free Robux so that you can actually upload your shirts on Roblox, click on this video right here and it'll take you straight to it.